So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a walkthrough of the collection, having a look at some of the new growth. Um, this table might look a bit empty because my large Rebecca Soper is, and my Copperlandii offered the Easter show to be judged in a competition. So that's pretty exciting. Um, I'm not sure if my video on that will be out yet. I haven't edited it yet, so that might come out after this one. Um, so in that video, I'm like preparing the plants, getting them looking all nice and taking them into the show. Uh, so the first update, uh, this is my Nepenthes Lowei Cross Truncata Giant. And this massive picture has finally opened. So as you can see, it's very large, um, has a nice striped peristome. Th um, this plant has pictures much more elongated than the other one. So you can see this one is more colourful and um, the picture body is wider. I well, we can't really say wider, it's um, shorter than this one. So you can sort of see what I mean. This one's more elongated. Um, over here, the third picture's opened on my Ventricosa cross Sibionentis cross Voco. So that's just popped. Um, the other ones have aged nicely. So one there, one over the other side. Um, the picture on my Boshiana still hasn't opened, um, so that'll probably pop open tomorrow even. Um, it's so close. Um, so the new plants are doing quite well. There's a new leaf on my Chaniana, uh, the Jamban. Uh, yeah, that's actually going quite well. Um, I haven't put my Nepenthes flavors out here yet, so I'll do that after this video. Uh, Glandulifera's got a new leaf on the way. Um, this massive new leaf on my Trucata Squat Cross Nebularum is probably going to well, probably going to make a big picture. Um, over here, this is my area for sort of the plants that aren't doing well. Um, that double leaf on that cutting's pretty interesting, but my Bill Bailey's finally producing nice pictures. So that plant's supposed to be an easy grow, but it's really been struggling for me lately. Um, over this side, we have my Maxima Dark that was struggling, but now it's not. Has a nice picture in there, but this new one, haven't even had a look at it yet. Oh my gosh, look at that flared peristome. That's amazing. Oh, never seen that on a Maxima before. Now you can see those other pictures don't really have that flare. Um, Miranda's going well. Oh, um, forgot to check on the new picture of my... Uh, Maxima trismartiensis. Where's that gone? Oh, it's actually dropped down here. So it must have filled up with pitcher fluid. But that's looking very, very nice. You can see that striped peristome. There's the last one, which is coloured up nicely. It's got some ants on it. And there's a new one about to pop open there. So this plant is doing very well. I'm very excited for when that basil gets a bit larger and starts producing pitchers. Uh, Miranda's got a new picture around the back. Bit of a deformed peristome, but still very nice. Uh, Truncata cross mirrors putting out a new leaf. Um, this Alata picture's quite nice. It's coming off the plant over there. Uh, Ventricosa cross Jacqueline appears to have a new picture, although that might decide to die off randomly. Um, new picture on my Maxima. But other than that, not much else. So I'll probably get that um, Easter show video out, uh, video out before this one. But if I don't, I'll put it in the end screen. Um, okay, so thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.